I welcome you again to my page. And I know that is the grace of God that we are alive to witness today. And that grace must not be taken for granted. Today, I will talk about if Job is not committed suicide, where will I? If Job is not committed suicide, where will I commit a suicide? But before I proceed, let's go to the book of 1 John chapter 5, verse 4. Which says, Whosoever that is born of God, they are an overcomer. And this is the victory that overcomes the world, even the faith. There are a lot of things in the world that can make someone to commit suicide. Marriage is not perfect. Career is not perfect. The entire world is not perfect. Our heart is not perfect. Loneliness, frustration, anxiety, lack of needs can make majority to commit suicide. But John sent a letter to every believer he said there is one thing that overcome this stress and that one thing it is faith and it makes us to realize that whosoever that have this faith that overcome the world the reality the righteousness of god become reality in their life brapo said something in the book of ephesians 6 uh, uh, Ephesians 6 verse 16 he says take the sheet of the faith why is this why Brapo tell us to take the sheet of the faith it is because only faith that offer us to the place of the destiny Ephesians chapter 2 verse 8 says we are all saved by faith 2 Corinthians 1 24. He says that we are walk by faith. 2 Corinthians 5 verse 7. He said we stand by faith. Matthew 9 27 to 29. He said we are here by faith. We can see that all the challenges, the battle that anyone may be passing through. They are all answer to the authorities of the Bible faith. Faith, it is what your victory in every battle of life. And anyone that is not having this faith, the Brapo, uh, Bra John tell us in the book of 1 John chapter 5, verse 4, it shows that they are living their life in the chance. Anyone that is not, anyone that is not living, that is living outside the will of God, that is living outside the will of Christ. They are living their life in the chance, and they are not yet the child of the destiny. I pray for my viewers today that they are watching this program. Whatsoever the challenges that you are passing through, the Lord will give you victory over them all, in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray whatsoever the situation that may make you to think of suicide, God will grant you an answer. He's the only one that can comfort you. And I join my faith to every woman that lost their children in the battle that is going on in the world in Nigeria, that the Lord will comfort you. I pray for every parent that they have lost their children, they lost their lo loved ones. That only God can comfort you and the Lord will comfort you. He will give you the grace to overcome these challenges. Stay blessed.